Well, I started around 2004. Uh, I was in secondary school and uh, I was actually, I didn't have any intention of being a club DJ or any kind of DJ in that sense. Uh, I was actually just trying to find a way to play in a band. Unfortunately, I suck at playing at the guitar and drums and everything else and I couldn't sing for nuts. Um, but then I had a, well, my favorite band at the time was Lincoln Park and uh, I was actually watching a, a live DVD concert of them um, and there was actually one 15 second segment of the uh, concert where the DJ had a scratch solo and I thought it was like the best thing ever. I'm excited by the new producers that come about. Um, like some guys from my, my label, Firelight Digital, uh, like this is a guy called FZPZ or Fox, you know, they're new guys, they just came out of nowhere and they're just making the best music ever. Um, and it's actually cool, you know, since they're coming from Singapore. The one thing I like about certain Asian music, like some stuff that I've heard from Hong Kong, you know, Shanghai, they play like really, really weird as music, you know, like a, a combination of like old Chinese, like uh, traditional music with the clubbing sounds and everything. I mean, taking that chance of playing, of emerging the old and the new, the traditional and the, the new school, I think that makes things very interesting. And I feel that a lot of the people in the West just like to stick with a certain formula, which I guess, isn't wrong, but it kind of gets stale after a while. So I guess from that perspective, uh, you could learn some, some, some tricks from the, the Asian side. Uh, Panopticon is basically my own version of Boiler Room in a sense. Uh, it was actually just a, a glorified house party. Uh, like a couple years ago, we uh, just had a little gathering at my place and we just thought it'd be cool. We had it recorded on video for old time's sake, for, for memory's sake. And then uh, we found out why don't we just stream it live to our friends that couldn't make it down to the house. And from there, it just came from one party to the next and it just kept growing and growing. And now it's just became a, my own show. I guess Panopticon would be the biggest, the biggest thing right now uh, for me in the sense that uh, I'm, I'm always trying to find local talents around Singapore and then I'll be playing alongside them sometimes, uh, bars, clubs. And then once in a while, I'll be traveling to Hong Kong or New York. Um, I guess a lot of people in Singapore are, well, I guess in, not only Singapore, but around the world, they're so focused on um, only listening to what's good on the radio, which is fine, you know, it's fine. Uh, you like what you like, but there are a lot of good stuff out there if you actually just open your mind to it, you know, just because it's not in top 10 of, you know, of your local radio station doesn't mean it's not good. You know, you just gotta take a chance and dig deeper. There's way more good, good stuff out there if you actually give it a chance. Big up Soy Music TV. Shout out to Shoy Music TV. Yo, what up? It's the boy Way from Titania. I want to thank Soy TV for having me. This is Jing Wong from Hong Kong. Can't get glad. Farm Real Record. I'm Drew Chen. This is your boy Joe Flizzo. You chilling right now. Subhan Jaya. This is the hood.